We're talking about bunions and new surgical techniques that claim to result in pain-free surgery and fast recovery in 97% of patients. A lot of people just don't believe it's possible. Let's find out what our first guest has to say about it. Please welcome everyone, Karen Everson. Now, you are in the boot right now. I am. It's been three weeks. It's been three weeks since your surgery. Yes. Now, what made you do it? I had a bunion previously before in eighth grade is when I had surgery by a previous doctor and in five years it grew back and it's been causing me pain for the last three years so I heard about Dr. Moy on the health channel and was just inspired by what his new procedure was mm -hmm. so I decided to go with him. Now there's a lot of doctors out there and you have a lot of choices but there must be something particular about Dr. Moy that stood out than any other. I would say the pain-free part of it because the first time I had a lot of pain for about a week and I was on crutches for two weeks. So it's interesting because you can actually compare and let the other viewers yes, know. Yes, absolutely. Yes, and I'd, I'd be ready to do my left foot as well. Karen's an example of bunion surgery done by another doctor that really wasn't a permanent solution to the problem. But Dr. Moy's record of providing a permanent cure for bunions is outstanding. Let's welcome our next guest, Kara Bellsby, to tell us all about it. Well, now you walked up here freely. Yes. And you've had bunion surgery on one foot or two? One. One. And it was by Dr. Moy? Yes. Why did you choose Dr. Moy? Actually, he's, he was a friend, and I knew what he did, and I uh, heard other people say really great things about him. I knew he was you know, very professional, very good, so I just went to him. Now, tell us about right after the surgery. Did you have any apprehension? I mean, you haven't had it done before. I, I just knew that I had pain in my left foot every time I wore heels, and for a couple of years, I just endured the pain, and finally, um, you know, Richard said, you might want to come in and have me look at it, and um, diagnosed me with degenerative arthritis. I didn't know that so many other people had gone through such a hard time because I just knew that when I got it done, it was wonderful. Because the next ago day, did you have the surgery? It was eight years ago. Now you would strongly recommend Dr. Moy, right? I refer everybody to him. You yeah. do. Mm -hmm. I was um, in pain for a couple of years. I didn't even know I had a bunion, and I went to another doctor to have him look at it, X-ray it. He just said I had um, arthritis in my toe and I needed to just deal with it and there was nothing we could really do. So I would just spend the day limping and that's how I got around through life for a couple of years. I went into Dr. Moy regarding something else and he looked at my toe, touched it and you couldn't even touch my toe without it wrenching in pain. At that point said why don't we go x-ray it, look into this, and I said, please do, and he said, there's no reason for you to be like this, and he came out and said, this is what you've got, you know, we can definitely help you and get you better, which, you know, when you're in pain, that's all you want to hear is we can get you better. Isn't it something to look that far back and remember? I just remember being in a lot of pain, and, and he fixed it. Right. Well, congratulations. Thank you so much for sharing. Thank you.